Hey guys, welcome back to BJ Tech News, and this is Bernardo. Yes, and we are back. Uh, this is a quick tip or a quick update. Don't really know how to reference this video, but uh, most likely, on what I'm going to go over, the topic of this video is how to watch Netflix on Ubuntu with the Netflix desktop app. Yes, believe it or not, uh, a developer have created a package a Netflix app for the Linux machines. Uh, back then it wasn't able to do it. You had to go some other way around, do like a virtual machine, but believe it or not, uh, someone has taken the time to create it. So the first thing that we need to do is I downloaded uh, Ubuntu 12.0, which is the latest version, I believe, a desktop, installed it. Once you get it installed, you want to get into the terminal. And within terminal, you have to do three commands. Now, the first one is sudo. Always gotta use that super user uh, app. Now, it's gonna take me a time to type this stuff out, and the reason is because you know I, I still got my broken hand. Hopefully, they get this broken hand thing going. I can't type with one finger. It's such a such a pain. Space. Uh, there we go. Over. Uh, can't stand having this pecking stuff. This pecking stuff is just crazy. And we're gonna hit enter. We're gonna put the password. And we're gonna hit enter. We're gonna let it do its thing. That's good. And then we're gonna do another sudo command. And it's gonna go to app get update hit enter. Now the sudo app get update is basically going to you know the server that you see that IP address usarchive.ubuntu.com and it's retrieving all the latest and greatest updates that your Ubuntu machine needs. Once it completes, the last command that you need to do is sudo app get install net flix netflix desktop ah, gotta spell it right this one finger thing ain't working and then hit enter it's gonna start downloading you wanna hit yes now the process of this takes a while It looked like it finished. Um, I'm going to minimize my terminal and you want to go into your dash home and do a search of Netflix and it should pop up. Now, when you click on the app, uh, the app has to finish installing. The way that you know it's completely done is when uh, the big page of the Netflix pops up and you can log in and start watching videos. As you can see, Wine needs to configure itself and it needs to update itself. So this portion right here takes a while. It's a, I, I believe you have to click maybe two or three times install when it prompts you for it to completely finish.
and we back as you can see it is completed so basically this is how it looks if you're a member you log in and that's about it guys hopefully you guys enjoy this episode and i catch you guys later peace out